So welcome to Expo TV. Now, Jean-Luc, you spoke on the panel today. You discussed, I mean, it's a well-attended panel as well. You discussed the changes in the satellite industry. Satellites, of course, in great demand and production times for manufacturers are getting shorter. How did that discussion go? Oh, it went very well. The panel was attended both by satellite operators as well as manufacturer and by NASA. So we discussed the various way to uh, shorten the uh, production cycle to bring satellite back into orbit uh, much faster than we're doing today. And as a satellite operator, how do you experience that shift in demand yourselves and how do you see that being dealt with over the coming decade? Yes, I think uh, a lot of the demand we're seeing is mobility. Uh, people want ubiquitous uh, coverage. They want to be connected all the time, everywhere they are. So that starts with connecting when you're on your, on your flight, uh, you want to connect to the internet, cruises, maritime, anything that is mobility. That's where the, the demand is these days. And the Internet of Things, that's having an impact as well on satellite operators, isn't it? That's correct. Internet of Things is the next uh, big uh, customer application and uh, that's coming up with uh, the new uh, satellites we're developing and, and going to be launching soon. Uh, so which technologies, for example, software-defined satellites and flexible payloads are really interesting for you as operators? I think the ultimate goal is uh, to get to software-defined satellites. That would be a satellite that would be pre-built, sitting on the ground, and when you have a customer demand, you'll just pick the satellite up, launch it, and then configure it in orbit. You have to be able to configure the coverage in orbit, the power you want over a given coverage, the uh, connectivity between different coverage, as well as the frequency. But that's the ultimate goal, software-defined satellites. Jean-Luc, thank you for your insight. You're welcome. Thank <laughs> you.